This video is all about fat loss, weight loss, are they the same thing? Well, yes and no. But the reason why I wanted to upload this video is that I get lots of people going to me, oh, I want to lose body fat, oh, I want to lose weight, oh, I want to get in shape. And I go, well, there's a gazillion books written about diet, so it can't be that fucking hard, can it? But obviously it is if the, you know, more than half the population or 45% of the population now is obese. Now, the only thing is, when they do the obesity measurements, if you're like me and hold a lot of muscle mass, and I'm over my BMI, they will go, I'm obese, but I've got 12% body fat. So that's purely wrong. So they wouldn't say Mike Tyson's obese, but he's 5'11", the same height as me, and a uh, heavyweight boxer of the world, but when he was uh, in his peak, he was 15 stone. So like 3 to 4 stone overweight of his body weight index, so that doesn't really work. So what diet do you need and what do you need to do in which to really lose weight and fat weight and quite fast? Now, if you really want to lose weight and you don't want to diet, just fast. So how you can fast is that what you can do is reduce your food intake over a couple of days so your body starts to adjust to having less and less food and then once you get to the, the state of having one meal then get down to no meals and just go to juices or soups and you will find that your body will change so if you were three stone overweight four stone overweight the least amount of food you have the more your body will use the fat as energy give you energy so you'll be able to lose huge amounts of weight Jason Park great YouTube channel about fasting and where he's used it for many different diseases to help people to overcome diabetes, to overcome, you know, inflammation in their body, as well as, you know, other diseases that he's worked with, with just using the method of just fasting. Now, don't get freaked out. Oh, I'm going to starve myself to death. That never happens. You know, if you was in a concentration camp, of course you be, you know, have skeletal bone and very low muscle mass simply because you're worked to death as well, okay? And they were giving them people really crap food. So with fasting, if you do intermittent fasting, you like one day on, one day off, one day on, one day off, you're reducing your calorific intake, you're getting your body to, uh, for the hormones to go a little bit higher as in growth hormone, so if you're exercising, you'll burn more calories, and when you exercise the burning more calories, you'll gain lean muscle mass, and as you gain lean muscle mass, you'll get leaner and feel better and look better. So there's a gazillion uh, books on diet, so which is the best book? Well, there's a, a system that I study which is called uh, the Metabolic Typing Diet. I've been using that for nearly 20 years now with my clients, always successful with them because when you eat according to your metabolic type it's very easy you don't count calories you're looking at the fat proportion to carbohydrate to protein so protein foods are eye foods any animal with eyes is a protein and any and, and any vegetable without eyes is a carbohydrate does that make sense so anything that has a beating heart is a protein and anything that is like plant is carbohydrate but it can get a bit confusing because nuts are high in protein and so are avocados okay so nuts don't have a, a beating heart as far as I know you know so uh, that's where it can get a bit confusing the other thing is if you really want to lose weight increase your fat intake so olive oil beef tallo lard uh, coconut oil things like this can uh, slow down the appetite and give you lots of energy so then you eat less and you lose weight okay so really important to eat them good fats add them to your meals or even add it to bulletproof coffee bulletproof coffee you uh, get some coffee beans gr grind them up uh, add it into a cafeteria add hot water add some butter or some coconut oil add some cream or some milk blend it in a blender and then you can drink it, okay? And that will curb your hunger for food again, okay? So really, don't get stressed out about fat loss and weight loss. They're both 
roughly the same thing. You know, if you get on the scales, you look lighter. You, you're showing that you're lighter. You feel better in yourself because you're lighter. And your dresses or your pants may fit much better. But don't be frightened of fasting. And don't be frightened of trying other diets like the Prittiging diet, the South Beach diet, the uh, Metabolic Typing diet. or there's, a, there's so many books on diet, it's so confusing. But... For me, using the metabolic typing diet, you're either a carbohydrate type, a mixed type, or a protein type. And when you find out what type you are, your body uh, changes dramatically. So if you've been eating too many bread, pasta, rice, and too much carbohydrate, but you need more eye foods like the, the beating heart foods, then uh, when you switch over, the body starts to change. But remember, if you want to keep your weight loss off, you need to be uh, religious or you need to have uh, discipline in which to stay in shape. So you've got to exercise, you've got to stay away from the foods, you've got to get to bed on time, you've got to drink your body weight in ounces of water, you've got to stay your prayers or like Hokokun would say, take your vitamins and all this type of stuff. So all this is really, really important. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to the YouTube channel. Please uh, spread this video. And if you need one-to-one -one help, please go to my website, Active Bright Systems. Or you can get some dietary advice in my book, Holistic Health for Proper Geezers, Classy Ladies, Get the Body and Fitness You Want Now. Thank you very much for listening to me. So get your guns out, get training, and get in shape. Bye-bye. Thank you.